Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be trying out this degreaser called Super Clean. Stay tuned. So just a little bit about this product, it's called a Super Clean. It has in, it comes in three or four different forms. This is a foaming action. This is an aerosol can. I think this is the newest product they have. And um, this one is straight degreaser. Now it's supposed to be good to uh, degrease uh, a lot of things, but what I'm interested in is to see if it, it'll degrease my uh, barbecue stuff. So let's put these puppies to the test and see how well they work. So what I did here is I just kind of filled it all the way to where the um, the water would go over my grates and I, I poured the whole thing. I wanted to see how well this, this works. Test number one. Alright, let's go to test number two. I'm going to try this aerosol can. Um, this grate is from my, my barbecue pit itself. It has a lot of stuff on it. It has a lot of miles on it. I guess what I can do is uh, give, a, give you guys like a time lapse. What I'll do is I'll spray one side and then we can compare after a couple of minutes see what it looks like. So let's just start spraying this puppy down and see how well this aerosol can uh, degreases my cooking grate. So just so you know, if this stuff actually does work, I, I will have a link on the description below uh, where you guys can get your own through Amazon. It does say to not allow it for, for it to dry on any of the surfaces. So what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to get a, um, a brush and I'm just going to agitate it see how well it, it comes off. I do see some, I don't know if you can see the discoloration of the, of the foam where it's eating off of the, or it's knocking off the grease and I don't know if I can zoom in down there on this side maybe all of that is that nice grease coming off so we'll see all right I know I don't know if the camera can catch it but it did clean it pretty well of course this caked on stuff I would have to go in there and either I'll apply a stronger um, dosage of it or just kind of like scrape it off. If I look at my at the uh, rods going across they're all nice and clean there's no gunk on them so as far as the aerosol uh, aerosol can is concerned it's a uh, it does its job pretty well let's go check out my uh, smoking so we're back here at our, my smoking grates like I said they have been in here for about 15 minutes as as you can see the uh, the water content here got pretty dark and murk, murky but uh, let's uh, see what this what this uh, degreaser does remember this one was this baby here it was just a full strength degreaser. Now you are probably going to have to do a little bit of scrubbing. I mean the proof is in the pudding guys. Check it out. It did a really good job in cleaning my grates out. They look almost brand new. So this again was that that formula that it's just a straight degreaser. So I would give this a, a good review on that actual degreaser. Now let's go ahead and tackle, tackle the uh, door of my smoker. All right, so finally we're gonna try this uh, super clean 
degreaser on my door of my smoker. So that's been about a minute. As you can see, it's already starting to eat away at the at the grease. You start seeing more of the window. Let's give it another round, see what happens after this one. All right, so it's been uh, another minute more or less. So what I'm gonna do right now is just gonna apply a little bit of water. I'm just gonna go another round. And after this round, I will wipe it down a little bit with a towel just to get off some of the, the stuff that won't come off just by, by applying it. But look, just by doing this, this grease is already coming off right here. Just a little bit, not even with the finger. I'm just kind of messing with this here and it's already coming off. But uh, let's, let's go ahead and give it round number three. And on this one, just because I want to, I don't really have to, you can see it, it really is knocking down all the grease, but just with a paper towel, I'm just gonna rub it just to give it a little bit of that extra assistance. Once again, for the door, I did use this one right here. It's called the Super Clean Foaming. So uh, you can tell at the beginning, of before I started this, the inside and the outside, the inside of the smoker and the the door looked pretty much identical in color. Now you can see a major, major difference. Let's go and check out one other thing that I put to a degrease. All right, since I already had my degreaser in this water and I had already used it for my smoking grate, I said, might as well take advantage of it. So what I did is I used the, the drip pan. This is the one that goes on the bottom of your electric smoker that uh, channels the grease to the back. This is a, a big wide pan. This one gets all of the drippings, all of the uh, fats, all of the, everything that comes off of the meat. Uh, lands here this one does have some caked on foods caked on grease and I uh, put it in here for about 15 minutes to see if it would loosen it and clean it up I'm not gonna go through the whole process of actually cleaning it but I did want to show you the results of putting it in here for about 15 minutes and this is a uh, degreaser that had already been used for something else so you can see there's a lot of uh, coloration here there's a lot of differences in in the, in the levels of texture because there's a lot of grease but check it out check this out I'm just kinda doing this to it all that stuff is coming off this has been caked on from previous cooks and it's just coming off with my hand I'm not even using a, an abrasive brush or anything just kinda rubbing it off Let's see what this looks like after I submerge it again. This is just after one one little. I mean, that tells you a lot. All right, so my overall impression of this uh, degreaser is I'm pretty uh, impressed on how well it cleans, how powerful this, these degreasers are. This one, again, I used it for those uh, cooking grates and what you just saw right now, which was a drip pan. I used the whole bottle, so this one's shot. This spray can, I used it for the uh, for my barbecue pit uh, grate, cooking grate, and it, it did pretty good. It, it actually cleaned out my cooking grates. I still have about a half a bottle of this, and this is the one that I use right now on my smoking, or my smoking door, the door of my smoker. Um, it did really well. Uh, I think I wanna say I have about, and you can see it, it's about right there. So maybe about two thirds of the bottle left. This has some grease because of my hands are all greasy. But um, overall guys, I would, I would recommend that you guys at least give this a try. There, it's pretty good. Uh, it's, it's a good alternative to something that you might use as like let's say purple power that might not be really meant for, for cleaning, um, I guess services where you're gonna be putting food. So if anything, it's a powerful, degreaser that is meant to be applied on stuff that's meant for cooking so uh, take that with a grain of salt 
Once again, this has been The Smoking Beard. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below. I do have a link to the description below if you guys are interested in getting your own set and try it out. And let me know once you buy it, let me know what you think. Thanks for watching.